Hey everyone, my name is Amy, and today I'm going to teach you how to build a little conveyor belt for your armor stands, so that you can display all the different types of collected netherite, or other types of armor, whatever you produce. Now, the design I'll be showing you today is using specifically 12 armor stands, and that encompasses the 11 types of trims, as well as the base netherite. Uh, they're mostly evenly spaced, uh, with just a little bit of a gap between, let's see, this one and this one. But it's really, unless you're specifically looking for it, you're not going to notice it, especially when they're all spinning around like this. Now, of course, the actual armor and display is quite expensive, um, but you'll see that the conveyor belt itself is really cheap actually. All you need is some packed ice, some pressure plates, and some building blocks. There's also an optional little bit of redstone, um, but you can also replace any of these for signs if you want to either reduce lag or stop the noises from appearing. Okay, so to actually build this, you're going to want to start out with a 5 by 14 either pole or walled off area. And then you want to take this area and fill it pretty much all the way in, just so there's a wall for them to, I don't know, like bounce off of. Uh, and then you can fill in the middle, you don't really have to though. Uh, I put here on this second block a repeater on four ticks, a redstone dust, a block, and then your dispenser with 12 armor stands in it. Now, I would put some trapdoors here, but you can put blocks as well and put some sort of display front here. Um, and then starting on this block, you put one, skip three on the corners, uh, not place it while you're standing there. Skip, yeah, skip three on the corners, then two on every other block. Just like this. There you go. And now place water on everyone that's next to the pressure plate. Just like that. Now to actually get it started, what you want to do is just jump on it quickly or throw an item on it also works and that should actually do pretty much perfect timing you'll see that it's a little bit off on the last one but it's really it's so close that it's hard to tell right here where it would it yeah see it fired just before and after you've got all those placed you can come right down here break that and break these as well and you can fill this in with whatever you want and then put all your different armor on here. You can expand it to have more. Uh, I could possibly post something about that later, but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye!